Well, you know me, if, since you've seen me work before, I, I don't like to try to make a cut, uh, a precise cut right to, uh, on, a, on the first try. I like to sneak up on things. And, you know, with this much blade sticking out, there's going to be some deflection, even on this big, strong saw. You know, this is not the sharpest blade in the world, but I'm, I'm going to make it work. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to use this to pass the work here. My hands are going to be up in a way nice and safe. And uh, so I looked here at my, my scrap piece and I can see that uh, you know I'm not going to come all the way to the edge here when I, when I make this first cut. I'm not going to be, but that's okay. I just want to, I just want to waste some stock and uh, get, get it out of my way and let this saw, if it, if it burns this maple or you know smokes or what have you that that's just going to be the way it is uh, you know but I I'm I'm pretty sure that I've got myself I think I'll even just give myself a just a, a whisper more space There's no reason I'd much rather take my time in situations like this than make a mistake and then have to start one of my pieces over Okay, so I've got everything. I, I set the square, I set the fence ex exactly square, and with this with this setup, I can dial the exact plumbness in of the, the fence system, and I also check this squareness too. This is not as critical as this, but uh, and the parallelness, but all that has been checked. It's locked down. Uh, let me turn my collector on and. Put some safety glasses on and I'm going to start cutting.
Yes, sir.